time for the adventure of Sir Daniel Fortescue. Will he be able to save Galomir? Let us find out. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Void. I'm Player One, and welcome back to Medi Evil. Yes, today we have the semi-final episode where we're going to do a whole bunch of cleanup. Uh, last time we went through Xerox Castle, the entrance hall, and the weird time one. That one was really weird. And that unlocked us the Lost Souls. So now we have to go back to, I think, every level in the game and, uh, and uh, do those. But I'm also going to take this opportunity to get any miscellaneous trophies, because there are a few of those left as well. Um, starting with the, the main title screen, actually. Kinda weird, but, uh, but yeah. This first one is I have to do a cheat code that was in the original release on the PS1. Alright, let's see if I can do this right. Triangle. Circle, circle, triangle, square, circle, left arrow, circle, up, down. I don't believe I did it right. I am actually a fool. You don't do it on the title screen. I don't know where I got that from. You, uh, you, you, you don't, you don't do it on the title screen. You have to go into a level. So, going into the entrance hall, because we do have the lost soul for this level. I'm pretty sure. Go here. Sir Sloan, Xerox dragons above. So we have to find some sort of dragons here? Okay. Let me kill these apes. Nasty buggers. Alright, I'm just gonna... So, to do cheat codes, you actually have to pause the game and then hold L2 and then do the the cheat code. Okay, let's try this again. Holding L2. Triangle. Circle, circle. Triangle. Square. Circle. L. Circle. Up. Down. Old school sneaky. Attempt to perform any original game cheat code. There you are. Alright. First thing down. All right, and I checked. I actually need to kill the imps with the lightning glove. For some reason, that's a trophy. So let me go ahead and get started on that. I don't know why specifically lightning on imps, but okay. And it said a dozen. I don't know where there's dragons in this level, so hopefully I can find that soon. Like, mm -mm. I would definitely assume it would be in this level. Uh, 
Why? Hmm? Hmm. I will figure this out. I'm not looking any of this up because I feel like I can figure it out. There's Zip Zap Imp Splat, who does an Imps with Lightning. Still don't have enough. I want a damn magic sword back. Hmm. Oh wait, wait, wait. I believe those are dragons. Here we go. It even it even it even says to open the inventory. Okay, here we go. Sir Sloan. Time to slay us some dragons. On guard. Okay. Kill dragons. Those are not dragons. Those are toads. Okay. So it seems like lost souls are you find them, then you go to a level and you do a little challenge. Wait, it was just a bunch of dragon toads? No matter. Collectively, I'll count those as one dragon. Lost soul, laid to rest. All right, very nice. That is our first one done. Very good, very good. All right. I wonder if that now, well, it doesn't say check mark on the soul, but you know, we got it and we, we laid him to rest, so it should be fine. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in the order of the ones we have. So the one we got from the entrance hall talks about fish in the village, which I believe is this level. So let us go in. All right, so this guy said fishing in the sleeping village, fisherman forms. Well, there's a lot of, a lot of fish here, so I believe I'll just walk around until we get to something. Oh, I forgot about these stupid guys. Is it be on like some sort of dock, maybe? Not sure where this would be. I'm an idiot. Brother literally says in the sleeping village. This level is called the sleeping village. Why did I not realize that? Okay. I I know I won't hurt them. Because there is a, a trophy for not hurting them, so I'm not gonna not gonna do that. Okay. Fishing? I don't remember there being any type of fishing thing here. I gotta even remember what the hell I'm doing in this level. Right, I have to make I have to make the cross with all the, the stuff. Is there a... 
dock or something down here? I guess down here. closest to water we've gotten here, so I don't know where it is. Alright, we need this. Need this. I got enough health, I can just tank all of you possessed people. This level was really windy. There's the blacksmith. Don't have what I need yet. Fishing. What do you mean, fishing? Oh, here we are. Here we are. This has got to be it. Yep, that's a dock right there. Oh, these guys are going to annoy me, though. Activate it. Activate it. I know those fish are still in there. I'll bait them out. What is what is that? Mean? Oh, you want me to kill the fish? With these stupid people running muck on me? Okay, okay. I can do this. I can do this. Give me my bow. Ah, god damn it. Luckily I have a lot of health. Where the hell did- where did you come from? I have to kill these things too? God damn it. These trees are getting in my way. Now hopefully the trophy means harm as in kill them, not just hit them once. Those fish are fried. You're off the hook. There we go. Our soul laid to rest. Number two. Now I gotta get through the rest of this level. And also find the soul that's in this level. I don't know where that'll be. Why is this guy still chasing? Go away, man. I really do not remember which way I'm supposed to go. I'll meet you back when I find something. I finally found it. It was way at the end here in this final section. Have you seen my grave anywhere? I seem to have misplaced it. Perhaps ask the angel. She could give you some pointers. Luckily, I know the exact level that is. Okay, so now I'm pretty sure I can just finish up here and get that one trophy. I will meet you when I do that. I'm at the end here, I beat the, the guards, and then these nasty things showed up. Is that just because I freed the lost soul? That's some shit. 
They're changing the levels entirely now. Oh, come on, die. There's more? What the hell? Just let me finish the level! Come on. Come on. Okay. Damn. I don't know why I had to add all that. Where's my trophy? God damn it. Okay, I've done the whole level again, and I made sure... It's not their fault they're mad. There. When they say don't harm, they mean don't harm entirely. Don't, don't just not kill. Do not touch them in the slightest. Ma'am, that was annoying. Okay. Well, now, we go to a level that is very, very, very much easier. Man was talking about a grave and an angel. So we're going to the graveyard for the first proper level. It's been forever. So let's see what we gotta do here. Where the soul is here. Also, yeah, I need to smash a severed hand. That's just mean. There's that. That was a Book of Galomir entry, too. We didn't kill any of those? Huh. I also need to destroy tombstones. That's another one. Oh. Well, here's this. That was quick. Hey, tough guy. I've got a proposition for you. Meet me by the old windmill. You know, the one with the broken blade. Um, that's in the Scarecrow level, I'm pretty sure. Okay. So I'm just gonna be here smashing tombstones, and then I'll go to the angel. It really has been forever since we've been here. I think the trophy was 30 tombstones. Not sure how many are here, but I'm pretty sure we've smashed a couple before. So maybe it's already almost done. Where is the angel? I forget. It's near the end, right? Um, right, I need to go in. Yeah. Get that, go over here. Almost have enough gold to get the sword back. Thank the Lord. Oh, right, forgot. Okay, here's the angel. So, yeah, open inventory. Gravekeeper Kambik. My grave must be around here somewhere. The angel can point us in the right direction. Um. Okay. I just gotta find his grave. I'm gonna guess it's over here. 
but first let me uh Oh, there you go. Yes, that's the grave. I'll hold on to it better this time. Nobody had better destroy it. There would be grave consequences. That, that was it? What would happen if I were to destroy it? I'm very tempted, but mm, it already said he was laid to rest. I don't know what will happen. A super boss might pop out or something. Nah, I'll just, I'll just finish the level like a good boy. I will destroy other tombstones, though. He's a free game. enough. I finally have enough. Give me it back. There we go. Put that shit on immediately. <sighs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright, let me get to the end here. I don't need to grind for tombstones just yet because we still have return to the graveyard to go to, so that might uh, be enough in that one. Alright, there's that. So now... Talked about the windmill? Yeah. On to Scarecrow Fields, oh joy. Hopefully the sword does a good bit against the Scarecrows. Alright, let's go in. Alright. And, did I have two? No, okay. Brute Bruti. A broken blade. Alright. I can just go straight there. I don't got any other stuff to worry about in this level. I can just I can just go there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It melts the scarecrows. Oh I love this sword. I love this sword so very much. Does it just mean... There are a few windmills here, so I don't know which one it means. I need a ranged weapon. Lost soul for here. Good thing I went over here. Some careless hag left an eye of dragon toad on the floor. Now our old coven is swarming with ants. Be a deer and stomp them flat for me, would you? Okay, I think that's um, I think that's Cemetery Hill where we got the the witch talisman. Okay. Windmill. Here's one. I guess it's not this one. I guess it has to be the other one.
What the hell? What the hell? When did it do that? I think it has to be this one. This is the only other windmill, I think. Yeah, here we go. All right. Wait, I have to get in front of it. All right, brute brutey. All right, tough guy. Let's see how you handle my new tougher gauntlet. Make it to the end and I'll give you something nice. Gauntlet? Oh, brother. So we gotta go through this section, but it's harder now or something? Great. Okay. Ooh, close. I mean, buddy, it's, it's looking looking the same so far here. I mean, sure, things are faster, but not really that much harder. I'm, is this already the last bit? Yep. Guess you made it. Here's the nice thing I promised you. You have a very lovely eye. Tough guys like you probably don't get a lot of compliments. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, all right, there's, there's that. That one was quick and easy. Okay. So now, talked about the witch's old coven. So, gotta go to Cemetery Hill. And there definitely is a trophy here have to get up the mountain without taking damage. Now luckily we have good shields now, so hopefully I can do it this time. All right. Oh, there's tombstones here. So over here... I had to have a club. Let me rest out the hammer. Alright. Is this, is this already the place? Chen the Enchantress. Books by Firelight, there you go. Oh good, the exterminator is here. Let me shrink you down, mind the growing pains. Shrink me down? What the hell? Uh. Ants again. This is pretty cool. We're in the same area, but now we're just tiny. Hmm. These ants are nothing to me now. Not when I have my busted ass sword. That should do the trick. Good pest control, so hard to find. Uh, there you go. Now we gotta find... the other one. Is it in here? Doesn't look like it. That's a shield. Yeah, okay, so we can leave this bit. And now we have to trek up the mountain.
Do I have enough money to top up my shield? Oh, hello. Here's you. An awful little hand stole my wedding ring. It fled to the graveyard just past the skull gate. Give that thief a slap on the wrist. Okay, that's returned to the graveyard. Oh. Man, we are broke now. Ah, shit. Okay. I guess now, just gotta do it. I don't remember seeing that stone. Is there a goodie behind it? No, it's just a random stone. Huh. Okay. I'm definitely not gonna be able to do this first try. Let's just go. Regular rocks seem to do more damage to the shield than the magma rocks. Is that it? Did I do it? Rock Wrangler! Avoid all the rolling rocks and Cemetery Hill. Thank the heavens. I did not want to do that again. We are getting this stuff done. Very nice. Definitely need to top up my shield, though. I need to figure out a way to grind money. All right, time for return to the graveyard. How many have we done already? Done a few. But I'm not stopping till we do all of them. All right. Ye old Olivara, graveyard's highest hill. That was past, right past the skull gate, so. I still need to destroy tombstones. Oh, hello. Good. I was having a great day, then my patients murdered me. Now it's a very mediocre day. Let's give those patients a taste of their own medicine. Okay. Patients. There was an insane asylum, right? Yeah, there wasn't there was an asylum. Okay. Oh, that was the gauntlet level, I'm pretty sure. Alright, that shouldn't be too bad. Shocking lack of respect. There we go. A hundred gravestones. I thought it was 30. Oh. All right. I think almost done with the miscellaneous trophies. I think. All right, here we are. Right past the skull gate. I'm waiting for that open inventory prompt. Oh, atop the highest hill. Yeah, here we go. There's the thief. Unhand my wedding ring, you sticky-fingered fiend. Oh, it's a bunch of, it's a bunch of hands. I 
and whack a hand. Do I gotta get all of them? I, I ain't found that, that ring yet. There we go. Caught red-handed. You really nailed this one, Sir Dan. Thank you. Ha ha ha. Alright. Still need to fight the... Yeah, we need to complete every level for the stuff to count, right? So I still need to fight the boss. I'll be right back. Alright. Back inside the asylum. And, uh... There is definitely something with the chicken drumsticks. There are two trophies tied to them. So, let me see here. There it goes. There it goes. Colonel Fortescue's special recipe. Turn an enemy into a roasted chicken and eat it. That's what the damn chicken drumsticks do. I don't know how we didn't do that at any time before, but there you go. They're like a bomb, and they turn all enemies into a chicken. Beautiful. And there's another trophy for throwing 42 of them. So, yeah, I'll be, I'll be completing that when we get to the uh, hilltop mausoleum. Because then I'll be able to replenish the ammo. I wonder where the soul stuff is here, because this is just a straightforward level. And now it is piss easy thanks to the magic sword. assume it's not like in any of these rooms it's gonna be at the end because that's the only like sort of open room many enemies. I don't remember there being this many. Alright. Thank you for all that. Here's the patience, right. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. All right, Surgeon Sherman, ring around the asylum. Patients are falling ill. Diagnosis, snake bite. What does that mean? Uh, snake? What the hell? Snake? Is that the evil snake or is that our friend? I think that's our friend. And it's not doing any damage to me, so... It's been a while since we've seen you. Our good friend Snake. Snakenton. Question is... Do I just have to wait for you to despawn? Is that the, the whole thing? Because usually the, last, the Lost Souls have just been like little challenges, but this... This is helpful? I already killed all the patients, though.
I mean, I can lock on, but I don't think I can hit him. Oh, is he on? Is he on now? I'm I'm not sure what that was. Did I did I fulfill it? I don't know. Oh, was he going to follow me? Is he going to follow me in here? I don't know. Let's just hope I go through the level and it counts as the soul being done. Okay, good. The treatment appears to be successful. Operation complete. Good. Now I assume the soul found here is here. Hello, Mr. Mayor. Yep, soul's just right in there. What do you need? My wonderful pumpkin tower has been invaded by shadow demons. How did those horrible beasts get free? Who could have done such a thing? Pump? Pumpkin tower? Is that the pumpkin level? I would assume? I think there was a tower in that level. And Shadow Demons, I think, are the little challenge there. Which, Shadow Demons are nothing to me now. Since I have the Magic Sword. Yeah, we go here, and then... Yeah, Pumpkin... Pumpkin Gorge. There is something at the Pumpkin Serpent, too, though. Alright, Pumpkin Gorge, here we go. Alright, here I am at the top of said Pumpkin Tower. So I think I just have to fight some shadow demons, which should not be hard at all. Sir Schmidt the Hermit. Those stubborn shadow beasts are back. I just want them to leave me alone. Don't worry, sir, they will. Because they are nothing. Easy as that. Thank you, sir, Dan. You are a true hero. Please find whoever freed those shadow demons and bring them to justice. Uh, see ab ab about that. That was me. All right. Still gotta find where the soul is here. So hopefully it's nearby. Wasn't this basically already the end of the level? I don't remember. Go up here, do this jump, and we do this. Okay. Where is this soul? Right. 
they just gonna put it right at the end? No. So I've missed it. Great. I, I didn't even know that was a thing. I didn't even know you could go in here. But that's where he is. Everyone talks about the Pumpkin King, but no one mentions the other plants. They're the root of all evil. Always watching, waiting, stalking. Alright, well that just sounds like go to the Pumpkin Serpent now. Okay, now I can finish the level. Alright, well I just started the level, and the soul is uh, just next to the Witch Cauldron. I grow weary of that noisy phantom's meddling melodies. Make his organ pipe down before we give him a sound thrashing. Alright, well that's the hilltop mausoleum. I remember that phantom, we helped him out. We gotta, we gotta kill him now or something? That's messed up. Alright, now I don't know where the activation for the other soul is. The other plants? I've been across the whole level, so... Maybe I just have to beat the boss first? I guess we'll see. is a big old cheater because I I drain his health bar and he's just like no do it again and then he's like no do it even again At least it's only three times, though. mean by other plants because new plants spawn so I would assume now I can do it all right now I'm just gonna walk around until the prop pops up Yep, there we go, right there. P. 
Peter Peter Pumpkin Weeder. King Free Pumpkin Patch. Those are the seedy plants. Cut them down to size. Oh, these guys. Well, these guys are nothing. plants have been uprooted. Our farmlands can finally turn over a new leaf. There you are. Good, sir. Okay, so now we gotta deal with the phantom. Which means we're going to the hilltop mausoleum. And since we're going here, I can uh, go ahead and finish the other chicken drumstick trophy. As I can throw a whole bunch of them and then let the Imp, take it, buy it back, and then finish it. Let us go. I wonder how many we've thrown already. Don't know. And do they have to land, or can I just throw them for it to count? There's the soul. Oh yeah. We just had to give it a little a little time for it to take effect. When it takes effect, ooh baby, I love the chicken. Rhino tars are in the maze. Cleanse them of their vile ways. I remember. I remember. It's got a pretty good range, too. All right. Should we go this way first? It's definitely been a while since I've done this level. Oh wait, no. We go the other one first? are falling through the floor. Is that because this floor crumbles? That's... that's weird to me. Oh well, let's go. Alright. Now we get this little grubby guy, and he steals it. We let him go, 
and then we buy back the chicken and it's fully stocked. Alright, there we go. Throw up here. Yeah, not do not want them to take my hammer. I have barely enough money as it is. That. Go up here. This. Hello, Phantom. What is your beef with the Phantom, man? Tr. Tr. Traverinus the Troubadour. He lost his music again. He can't even carry a tune without your help. Find his music sheets and let us rest in peace. 40? What the hell? Alright, let me buy back the chicken. It's only 100, which is good. And let me equip it. I gotta go through the whole level picking up his music. I already found his music before. Just put a whole bunch of collectibles in the level. Simple, but a little tedious. Alright, do that. Spawn the boss. But let me not activate him right at this moment. Let me first go this way. Oh, they even got them hiding in the in the little crevices. Mm-hmm. more. Yeah, I can't put any down there as well. There's not a guarantee those will stay up. There we are. That should do it. We'll call you back for future noise complaints. Lost soul. Laid to rest. Okay. There we are. The answer is chicken. Throw 42 chicken legs. That's a cheeky little hitchhiker's guide to the galaxy reference for you right there. I can take the chicken off. Don't have to use it ever again. Alright. Uh, that's it for this level. I'm just going to beat this guy again. We are here in the maze with Jack of the Green right over there, the nasty guy. And apparently it's right at the start. Baffy the Baffler, Grass Dragon. Right, because there was a hedge thing that looked like a dragon right there. Alright. Rhinotars, they're few but tough. Show those beasts some hero stuff. Of course. Um. You just... You, you just want me to... Go, go through the level now? Um. Oh, okay. 
Because I'm pretty sure the Rhino Tars are like right at the end of the level. Alright, I remember the start. We have to go to all the stars. Alright, I'll meet you back when something new happens. Oh. So it's just put Rhino Tars in the level. Oh joy. Oh, they it, it put quite a few of them in the level. Oh man. Oh, three Rhino Tars remaining. Okay, no, it didn't put that many in there. Hmm. Eh? Um. Why, why am I closed in here? Hello? Okay. I, huh, that was strange. My controller. My controller. My controller, please. Please. Oh, oh, oh. I always like to begin with an easy one. Return hither. You will not find my next conundrum so simple. Yes, I will. Pretty sure it's the elephant one. Wait, no, it's not the elephant one. It's... I live for laughter. The clown. I remember the clown. Alright. Now... This... no. This way's open, W. Okay. That's the last Rhino Tar. Hmm. Yeah, this level doesn't scare me as much anymore because uh, these guys don't uh, get near me as much as they once did. forget how this thing worked, but I'm just gonna see if this helps. No, it's... Okay, I'm gonna wait for them to reset. Okay, I got it. That part is always so annoying. Always so annoying. Shut up, Jack. You're not even cool. Trying to be Edward Nigma so bad, you are not the Riddler. And this will be the last, uh, Rhinotar. should do for now, I think. Now I need a spirit drink. What would that even be? Alright, now I gotta beat the level and figure out where the soul is for here. Hopefully it's nearby. I'll see you once I find it. Alright, well it was literally just at the start of the elephant cat section. Hello. A giant crystal fried my flesh. Hate it when that happens. Some gold left on my body, but that crystal may not hand it over so easily. Giant crystal. Is that crystal caves? I think that may be crystal caves. Unless talking about the crystal at the time level. Maybe. Don't know. I'll see you when when we get there. All right. It was in fact crystal caves because that looks like a a crystal that will burn you. All right. We got Gavin the Golden, Mellow Mead Mines, Lethal Crystal. 
There's my treasure right where I left it. My body's right where I left it too. Treasure's yours if you can take it. Oh. Get away from me, you damn bats. Uh, just get the money, I assume. has to be the simplest. I mean, yeah, it's a little challenging, but it's still simple. I think that was it. Uh-huh. You've got better luck than me, Sir Dan. Maybe just less skin to fry. Oh, uh, yes, yes, indeed. All right, time to find the soul here. Would you look at that? It was right nearby. May I hit a ride with you, Sir Skeleton? Meet me at the old fort by the ancient pools. I know exactly the level that is. That is the first little lake level where we first met Charon. Alright, well now... Man, I basically just started this level. I already got both things I need to do here. Well, I'll, I'll meet you when we get to the next one. Well, this is very awkward. I, I collected that, and it got us Sir Moneybags, which is... Uh, 10,000 gold. Didn't realize we got there so fast. All right, now now to the level. All right, here we are, Pools of the Ancient Dead. Let us summon the man. Knight McKnight. Please escort me to the base of the ancient battlefield. Just be mindful of the Swamp Guardian. I beat him in a game of tentacle tag and he's a sore loser. Okay, so more tentacles. Okay. What is the site of the ancient? Is this not the site of the ancient battlefield already? Don't know where specifically I have to go. Because technically, wouldn't it wouldn't this be all of this? you damn tentacle. Still need to get these so I can actually beat the level. I got... <sighs> I don't like how Dan is so slippery. I don't like it. Does he mean, like, literally at the end of the level, where there's the, the cart chase? Is that it? Oh. Chill way. And this is gonna take me a bit. At least the big guys are stupid. They can just immediately get sent to the drink. Really? I really didn't make that. Oh, come on, game. Can't you just be a little nice? Just a little tiny bit. Okay. This one. Go away from me, Mr. Tentacle. Oh. Here's the soul. 
My fellow prisoners used to call me the fastest runner in Gallows Gauntlet. They wouldn't lie about a thing like that. Fancy a race, Sir Dan. Ooh, a race. Hmm. Gallows Gauntlet. That's... I think that's the castle level. I think. I think it was called that? I... This is the level where we take the most damage. It's it's literally just this one, because... So very tiny room for error. Give me this. Okay. What are all these explodey chests doing here? I don't think they were there before. Uh, mm. Come on, don't die now. I've been doing so well this whole time, do not die at this moment. Shoot. There we go. That's what I wanted to happen. Okay. Now I don't have to deal with it. Tentacles are here, but that's fine. I can go here. Oh yeah. Definitely, this is the area he was talking about. Give me all this. Replenish my health. Okay. Thank you, Soskeleton. And the Swamp Guardian will get over it. He always beats me at hide and sink. <laughs> After this little challenge again. Alright, there's that one. And next will be Gallows Gauntlet, which I, I assume is the castle level. Uh, so I'll see you there. It is in fact not the castle level. I forgot this level existed. Uh, but thankfully it's a short one. Right outside the fire gate is Lost Soul. The ruler of rats has his sights set on my darling elephant dragons. Repel that repulsive rodent before he sends my precious pachyderms packing. Where have we seen elephant dragons? That's right. The lake level. And also, this is right where we summon uh, Hopper the Legless. Ready for our race? Hopper the Legless is going to kick your skelly butt. Ready? Go! Where Where am I going? Oh. Okay. Um. Not really. Brother, you're. You, you serious? I'm impressed. You managed to beat my record of 31 hours and 27 minutes. Perhaps I can finally retire. What? Um. Uh, oh, okay. Um. Sure. I will see you at the lake. Here we are. Let us summon Nautical Nokbar, the elephant dragon lair. Those villainous vermin are making their move. Rend those reprehensible rodents. Rat King Darok. 9,999. What? Did, did I did I miss him? I think I, I think I missed him.
Um, oh, there he is. Why can't that hurt him? Do I have to use a smashy weapon? There we go. My gentle giants have saved. You are sensational, Sir Dan. There... There you go, bro. Rip Rat King Derek. E. He just wanted to live. Apparently I'm strong as hell now though, because he had 9,999 health. Alright, I still have to find the soul here though. This is basically the end of the level already. It... No, I thought that purple was it. Hmm. It has to be nearby. My poor merchant friend, first locked in a forced cage, now trapped behind a wall of vines. He just can't catch a break. Forest cage. Well, there's only one level we haven't gone to that has a forest, technically. Sun Junior, son of Sun Senior. Wonderful name, I love that. I... I'm going to have to assume that goes to Enchanted Earth, because we haven't gone there yet. And that's the only place that has, like, a forest still. Uh, yeah. I will see you there. Shit. Okay, it is in Enchanted Earth. You just have to go to the start after releasing the Shadow Demons. Okay, Sun Junior, son of Sun Senior, here you are. Merchant. That's okay. It's a merchant gargoyle. I'm stupid. Those swindling vines are going to lift the shop. Make them pay. My friend is freed. I've never seen him happier. He's a bit stone-faced, but I'm certain he'll be glad to take your money. All I had to do was that. Wow. Where is the, uh... Where is the soul I gotta find, though? Where... Where is that? Alright, I had to kill the demonettes again, but here he is. I heard King Peregrine once captured the Serpent of Galomir. I dare you to open his courtyard door and see if it's still in there. You're not scared, are you? Okay, that one could not be more simple. It's the castle level, and, and yeah. Okay. I forget how to leave this level. Uh, oh wait, no, I remember. I remember, it's, it's over yonder. All right. We're almost done. Only a few more. And of course, it's it's the last levels all in a row. I, I just uh, noticed also the ant caves don't have one, which I guess makes sense since they're not on the map. So it's technically not like a real level. 
All right, but here we go. Only have like three more. Going to the haunted ruins. All right, right outside this door, Daring D. Castro. A member of the D clan? What the hell are you doing here? Wait, the ruins were true? That's your problem. I refuse to die again. The serpent of Galomir! Ah! Ah! You're not my friend. Die. Die, you nasty thing. Where'd it go? <laughs> I didn't know you could actually kill this thing, but apparently you can. That was a close call. Who would have thought playing truth or dare could get someone into trouble? We're playing truth or dare? You bastard! All right, well, I didn't kill the thing. And I just now realized, um, that's a trophy. I have to kill the thing. Oh, hello. I saw a giant crow up in me crow's nest. Largest I've seen. Wonder if it's up still there. That's, uh, that's the ghost ship. Okay. That is most indeedy the ghost ship. So that's where I'm going next. All right, here I am in the crow's nest, right in the middle of it, for Barrelman Badillo. Well, I suppose there'd be no crow here. Wait, floundering fish livers, there it is, look out! I knew it would be that fucker. Oh, that was it? Oh, oh, it was a close call. It is the dangers of having your ship so far up from the sea. I just had to tank one hit from the thing? Okay. Now let's hope the soul is somewhere here and I don't have to go to the lower levels. Because I haven't gone to the lower levels. And I don't want to. I'm not seeing the soul. Where is it? Come on, where the hell is it? I don't want to go to the lower levels. I don't wanna. <sighs> the fucking thing is down there. Okay. Oh, I, I'm, I'm stuck. Well, guess I have to fight him first. Weird. Yep. It was in this one. I once was a captain, but my pirates mutinied. Due to my lack of convincing pirate accent, my soul remains trapped in time. Perhaps that wizard's big clock can set me free. And that, lost and found. Find all the lost souls. Okay. We got one more soul to lay to rest. This has been quite a neat little side quest, but I'm so glad it's almost done. Before we go there, though, I do have one slight thing I have to do, because I didn't realize it was a thing I could do. I have to go to the gauntlet level and kill the Serpent of Galomir. Seeing it in the, in the castle level made me realize, oh, there's a trophy for killing that thing. And of course, the only other place it shows up is the gauntlet level. So I have to go ahead and do that. Make sure I don't miss any trophies. Oh, these just don't. Yeah, I guess that makes sense since the crew's dead now. All right, I will see you when I confront the serpent. All right, I'm here. I forgot the uh, the thing just just pops out. It doesn't. Uh, you don't open the chest. The thing just pops out at you. All right, come here, you nasty lizard. Oh, if it slithers, I slays. Kill the serpent of Galloway. That that was very easy. That that was supremely easy. 
Okay, well, looks like we have one more stop. And here we are. The final one. Captain Kaufman, a clock for all time. If I recall correctly, the big hand should be set to the number of force fields and the little hand to the number of brains. Okay. Well, I don't know that off the top of my head, but uh, I don't want to bother actually just going and looking. So, let me see. All right. So, silver is force fields, gold is brains. Um, there you go. That's, that's it. At last, I'm stuck in that clock no more. Now that I'm free, I can finally work on my pirate accent, matey. Soul Savior. souls to rest. Your legacy will be legend. Just know that legends are often not as crystal clear as the current world in which we live. Time can make things fuzzy, but the people of Galamere will remember you fondly nonetheless. You've unlocked something special on the main menu. All our souls laid to rest. Yippee! Ah. Okay, let me get through this level. Okay. So what did we get for doing that whole new quest that went through the whole entire game? But we have a new game. We have load game of options. But we also have old game. Oh, yes. That sound. Oh, it's beautiful. So when they said old game, they meant old game. Look at this. Holy shit. It's medieval. Classic. Look at, look, look, here, there it is. Look at him. Posed up. Looks cool as hell. Oh. Old. Ooh. It's so crusty, but it's crusty in a good way. But you know, <laughs> you know, Damn well, if the remake is already this hard, I don't want to touch that. But it's a it's a cool reward for the people who really, really, really like this game. Now then, I lied. We're not done yet. There is one more trophy that we can get right now, and it is die seven different ways. Now, when it says die, I don't know if it means like, oh, use a health bottle or full game over, but uh, I'm gonna assume it means life bottle because that is dying, you know? If we didn't have a life bottle, we would die there. So, I'm not sure which ones we've already done. We've definitely done falling, I. I know that. We've probably done water, yeah. I think we've done lava. And let me see what other ones there are. And I know for sure we've also done sink in the mud in Pools of the Ancient Dead. Apparently that's not water. Okay. So I think we have three more. It's die by an enemy. Well, actually, we've definitely had that too die by fire and die by time running out in the castle level, which I know for certain we didn't let that happen. So I'm going to go see if I can't die by fire and then go to here. So luckily there's fire right in this one. So we'll see what happens. Okay, so that should that should count for fire. Uh, now for the time limit. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, game over. Just straight game over.
I see the trophy is not popped yet. Crazy to start of the start of the level. Don't tell me it has to be game over for all of those. Do you know how long that's gonna take? I don't even know. Ugh. It's gonna fucking take forever. I don't even know which ones have we've done. Okay, I guess I'll start going down the list. Oh, Deathly Smorgasbord, okay. It looks like fire, was it? Good. Good thing I didn't have to do a whole bunch. That, that was very quick. Die seven different ways. I guess it was full game overs. Surprised we didn't... Yeah, I guess there wasn't any any chance of uh, us dying to a game over from fire. Fire's not really that common. All right, but uh, there you go. Hello, Dan. Looking straight at the camera. All the souls are put to rest. All the miscellaneous trophies are gotten. Everything is right in the world. Which definitely means there is only one more episode. One more episode of this game. Can't believe it. Feels like we haven't been here that long, but we're almost at the end. Joyous of joy. Uh, yeah. I'm going to stock up on things, so we will be ready for them. But, for now, I will end it there. I've been Blair One. And we'll see you next time. When we kill... Zarok and save Galamia. Bye-bye.